not too fast, it's sort of medium speed, ready? Jab, hook, uppercut. That looks good to me. It's really important for you when you throw hooks and uppercuts not to do this because you'll lose control. So both keep it quite close to your body. And with the hook, a good tip with the hook is when you throw it, think about following through with your elbow. And that tends to get you acid. Remember the bottom of our hands got to twist in. That's what most people do wrong. They don't get the big knuckles in. Jab, hook, bottom of the hand, not bad, still, still a bit more. Yeah? Uppercut. Where she went. <laughs> you do it like that, look, think about it. You do it like that, you're gonna hit it with your little knuckles. You're gonna hurt your hand. You've got to twist your fist in. That's the way it teaches kids to hook, and then they get it. We're going straight forward, you see. Jab, hook, that's it, that's it. <laughs> and up cut. That's not bad, you've got a good uppercut, you've got to work on your hook. Okay? Jab, hook, up cut. Because you've got the whole edge, keep it close. I'm going to go back on that thing. <laughs> Pull the hook because your arm's shaped like a hook and it's locked in a hook position when you throw it. And you twist the bottom of the hand towards you, yeah? That's it. Jab. Hook. It's better. Jab. Aggression. It's like a frustration. What do you want to do like that? Thank you. 